Mark gave his speech, stating, quote, My mother, Her Majesty Queen Margrethe II, has ruled Denmark for 52 years. Through a half century, she has followed the times with our common heritage as a starting point. She will forever be remembered as a regent beyond the ordinary. My mother, like few, has managed to become one with her kingdom. Today, the throne passes on. My hope is to become a gathering king of tomorrow. It is a task that I have approached all my life. It is a responsibility that I take on with respect, pride, and great joy. It is a deed I will make an effort to carry through the trust I encounter. I will need all the support I can get from my beloved wife, from my family, from you, and from that which is greater than us. I face the future with the certainty that I am not alone, connected, obligated, for the kingdom of Denmark." End quote. Then, Her Majesty Queen Mary of Denmark appeared on the balcony, along with Crown Prince Christian, Princess Isabella, Prince Vincent, and Princess Josephine of Denmark. At 3.30 p.m., Their Majesties King Frederick X and Queen Mary of Denmark departed from Christiansborg Slot in a gold wedding carriage, escorted by the Guard Hussar Regiment's Mounted Squadron to Frederick Palace at Emelianborg. The day ended with a transfer of flags and banners and the royal family appearing on the balcony at Frederick Palace at Emelianborg. Meanwhile, the Royal Court of Denmark released the King's official monogram, designed by Ronnie Anderson with digital assistance from artist Stefan Leigard. The monogram features two mirrored Fs with a Roman numeral 10 in the middle. So what's next for the king?